Hello everyone, and welcome to this week's speed paint. Alright, so, obviously I've been gone for way too long. I believe my last uploaded video was actually April 3rd. So, it's been a little over two months since I've uploaded. That being said, I want to say a special hello to not only my new subscribers, but also to all the lovely people who stuck around and came back to this video even though I've been gone way too long. Long story short, I was trying to finish up my first year of college I've definitely missed drawing, filming, editing, and interacting with you guys every week. However, instead of going back to that once a week schedule, I'm hoping to upload every other week this summer. I'm still going to sprinkle in a couple extra videos here and there, so that way it'll kind of be fun. If you want to know when I sprinkle in these little videos, I will have on my Instagram, I usually put on my story when a video is going to come out. So let's hop on to it. Today's speed paint is of Haru and Makoto from Free Iwatabi Swim Club. I started watching the series a while back and got to about episode 6. But then I didn't have a way to watch it anymore, so I kind of stopped. This piece I feel like was going out really well on the first day. I was loving the hair, I was loving the eyes, and like a responsible artist, I decided to stop filming since it was starting to get dark in my room and the villainy quality was starting to go bad. But then, <laughs> the next day came. First mistake of the day was Makoto's sleeve is supposed to be yellow. I tried my very best to fix it up and lighten it with rubbing alcohol and coloring over with yellow, but I had very little success with a huge mess instead. <laughs> the bleeding did however help me decide on the kitty's fur color. I was contemplating that one for a really long time and I never had a solution, so there's always the good in things. And honestly, I didn't know what color I was gonna choose for the cat, so in the end, it all worked out. <sighs> and here is where I try and use rubbing alcohol to quote-unquote fix my mistake. Goodbye 30 minutes worth of blending, you will be missed. I don't know if y'all are like this, but I feel like my opinion on art always goes one of two ways. It's either option A where I love it the whole time while I'm making it, but then the next day I'm like, wow, this really sucks. Or it's like option B where I hate it the whole time, I'm struggling, I can't feel like I'm not doing anything right, I feel like I'm totally fighting the piece, but then when it's finally done and I step away, I'm like, huh, this isn't so bad after all. This piece was definitely a tight B moment for me. I feel like I fought this piece the whole way through. I fought the sleeve, the sky, the hat, his clothes, just all of it. But then <laughs> the piece decided to fight back. Right when I went to trim up my picture, I had really decided I liked how Makoto's head, face, and hair turned out. I hadn't realized though that my piece was still wet, so when I went to cut it, I saw the corner that I loved and was just talking about rip. Don't worry though, this piece is now all doctored up and has a piece of tape on the back. <laughs> I laugh about it now because it was actually really strange that it happened to snag right when I was thinking this whole thing, but it was even funnier because the whole piece is wet, but that's the only corner that snagged the whole time. But at the same time, I was super done because this is the second piece I ripped this week. Coincidentally, it was also the corner though. But the other piece took me like a month to complete. So I was way more mad about that one. So on the bright side of that, it made the ripping of this piece not so bad since it only took me two weeks to do this one. But uh, <laughs> I definitely think that means I need to replace my blade. But anyway, I do overall really like how this piece turned out. I feel like, again, Makoto's hair and eyes turned out good. They're colors I wouldn't usually use together. One's like a gold, one's a clay color. But I feel like they were really worked out together. So, I don't know. That's my happy little ending, I guess. And I guess that's it for this week. So, bye. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have an absolutely amazing week. Bye-bye!